a rousing welcome for the All Blacks as they touched down in Dunedin last night ahead of the third test against the French. A healthy crowd greeted the team at Dunedin International Airport, much to the delight of the city's favourite son. Um, yeah, obviously we got a good welcome um, last night and oh, I think, you know, the good thing about Dunedin oh, Test Week is that... Um, I just think you know the city gets in behind it, so that's pretty exciting um, as a team to be in um, Dunedin and know that you've got that support. And I think also knowing that you're um, playing in a stadium that's got a roof uh, come Saturday, uh, Saturday, that also helps. So yeah, I think the team's excited to be in Dunedin. Ben cannot speak highly enough of that. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, he's been chomping at the bit since our first day at camp. Yeah. It was straight down to business for the players today though, debriefed in no uncertain terms after a stuttering 13 point win over a 14 man French side. French brought a bit of attitude um, and probably a bit hungrier so there was a bit of that mentioned in the in the debrief and um, yeah at, at the same time like we um, obviously managed to um, still get a win um, and we're excited by the week ahead. Also bound to be excited is Smith's Highlanders teammate Jackson Hemipore brought into the side as injury cover. A big thing with Jacko is he's like his physicality and I think he, he knows that he's um, you know he can match it with any anyone in the country as far as that goes um, at Super Rugby level so I think that's given him the confidence um, in his game to actually go out there and um, be dominant. And that's something the whole team will be looking for as they look to finish the French off in style. In Dunedin, the South today.